This is my fan base here tonight. <laughs>
is a new song. Love 
is like a friendship caught on fire In the perfume garden I smell the roses Thankful love, 
Gamble everything for love, gamble everything just for love. I'm a gambler. Sometimes I get lost. Should have gone right. I turn a little. I should have gone left. I turn right. I should have gone straight. I should have gone up, I should have gone up. Yum, yum, yum.
going to put my glasses on now because oh my God. I forgot the right ones. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I was gonna, this, is, this is a new song that I wrote in Paris. Ah, oh, that's better. Um, my mother told me when I was young, but uh, <laughs> it's a true story. I was going to get into a lot of trouble, Erin, because my lips would get me into trouble. That's exactly what she said.
think about what you've left behind. Everything is written now in the soul of the world. There's only one thing to learn. The wind knows everything. Go across the world. No place to hide. No reason to die. There's no reason to lie.
many miles I have disappeared Oh baby from myself Well, 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 well. Psychiatric hospitals most of his life. <laughs> Just He's like laughing. me. That's where I met him when I was a doctor. Despite <laughs> <laughs> my patient. D, mate. D. D for dog. This is, a, this is slang. Most of my songs are slang, actually. To, to be working with Alan again. Oh, he's, he's left already. Oh, there he is.
forsake me I'm traveling through the world trying to do the best I can Through trials and tribulations Your name is on my tongue I as a method to my madness Take me to the
because you read it in the Bible doesn't mean it's so. Just because the judge finds you guilty doesn't mean it's so. Before she uses you, 
Thank you very much. That's slang for talking about somebody and they suddenly appear. Especially someone you don't like. Oh, it never happens to me, of course. No, this one's a song called... Uh, what's it called? This one's called Like Mercury. E minor. Mercury is poisonous, of course.
next song is in A. I got no keys, you see. He's deafer than me. <laughs> and blind.
When we make love My spirit in blue Zule The first degree I said Azule The Atlantic Sea slang for no rest for the wicked basically. This is an you know, I live in Paris and the French get my sense of humour, I don't know why, it's really bizarre. Now I never offend anybody in Paris. Who's that? I recognise that voice. Yeah see, I offend a lot of people here I tell you, but in Paris I don't seem to offend anybody. Who's this? Demons played my dreams. 
dreams Why am I still awake? Why do I hesitate? Even less for the born again Rest for the wicked No rest for the wicked No rest for the wicked no rest for me Pay for your sins in double shots Live on and live you don't care Even less for the righteous heart But they don't even care Actions speak a lot of than words Miss my song, then come back and request the song. That's nice, isn't it, Aaron? Eh? Yeah, right. this is, we love it all. Yeah, that's right. Yeah, that's right. Too many drugs down there, mate. Oh. Lucky I've given them up. Trying to think of a song. Yeah, this one actually. Hey, minor. Too many drugs. What? <laughs> <laughs> Oh, 
fortune Across my palm and go It will come to be two hours from Kiev to Paris. I thought you'd like to know that in case anything happens to me. <laughs> Were you thinking of going? <laughs> I was thinking of volunteering for the Ukraine army. Yes. Yes? yes? No. Are you going to put it in an appearance? What'd you say? Are you going to put it in an appearance? Your band's a concert. Are you going to put, put Putin in an appearance? Oh, yeah, he's asked me to play it. Well, actually, he asked me to play at the big celebrations the other day, the 9th. But I said I was a bit busy. So I gave him my Greek name. I just, you know, when I get fish and chips from the Brighton Fish Supply in Osborne Park in Aloo there, I give my Greek name, they give me more chips, they give me more fish, it's great. <laughs> Voice 
restless one. Exactly, thank you. <laughs> I'll leave you to that one. 
uh, well, I'd like to give you the chord, but I haven't got a clue what the chord is. Al told me it was some it bizarre out. chord. Uh, I worked it out. He worked it out on his, on his app. I've still got it up on yeah. the app. Yeah. On his app for the chord. You know, I like to just put... Oh, shit, I can't find them, though. No, it's in what was it? What was it? Steve, play the notes again. E B. There was a B. E B. 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 I'm going to find the lyrics because I want to do it. Ah, oh, G major seventh with a B. <laughs> right. Ah, I got it. It's called Trouble Rides a Fast Horse, which is actually an Italian uh, proverb. I've got no idea really what it means, but I wrote this song in Paris recently. I'm going to do it tonight. <laughs> Better than 
That's the first time I've ever performed that song, which is good. Yeah, not bad, not bad. Like I do when I play with bands now together, and say, what the fuck is that chord? Yeah. Now Al's got to send me exactly what the chord is, that'll completely confuse them. G minor ninth with the G, G major seventh. G major seventh with the B. No wonder I sleep so well. I don't give a shit what the chord is. As long as I know how to play it. No, but I'm glad you told me what it was, Al. I completely forgot what you said, but I thought it was very interesting that there's an app. Someone told me there's an app for everything. Is that true, Aaron? Oh, yeah. Are you possible. finished? Or? Uh, I'm pretty, I'm, I'm running out of One more? Oh, okay. One, one more. Yeah. No, someone said to me there's an app for everything. And he, is, it, is that true or is it just bullshit? You know, is it, is it sort of... Not for everything. 2020 nerd talk. Or? Sorry, an app that can play music like you, Steve. Thank you, yeah, Alex. So that's true. Right. I think of actually uh, uh, forming my own app and putting it online. Probably get about the same number of people in this room <laughs> downloading it. No, this guy said to me, and what did he say to me? He said, "Oh, that's it. It was a, it was about stress." He's got. He said, "You can get an app that tells you when you're stressed." <laughs> I said, oh, that's great. <laughs> that's really good. Do I need an app to tell me when I'm stressed? You incredible. Said the app makes it's incredible, sense. really. But he was serious. Wow. He said, oh, it tells you, you, know, you can look it up and tell you how stressed you are and what's causing the stress. And if you're with somebody, Aaron, yeah. if you're with somebody yeah. and your stress levels go up, the app tells you that you, can, you should stay away from that person. Aaron. I reckon you... <laughs> I reckon you, you need one of those apps, mate. You, you need an app like that because too many people take advantage of you because you're such a nice guy. They can't get away with it with me because I don't give a fuck what they think, you know, so... No, but you, I reckon you need an app like that, mate. I'll try and find out where it is. <laughs> Any requests, Aaron? That wasn't bad, that's all. That was good. We already did gamble everything for last. I can't, can't even read one. my lyrics. I can't even read my song list anymore. Not enough red wine. But not enough red wine. Yeah. I don't know. Well, well, only time I drink is when I drink. I don't know why. 40. 40. 40. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, well, this one. This is very apt, actually. Oh. It's a great pleasure to be in the lucky country <laughs> with our great leader. God, he's a fucking idiot. God, this guy is the worst Prime Minister in my life. And I'm nearly 70. Worse than Tony Abbott? Though? Oh, yeah, worse. At least Tony Abbott was, you know, you could laugh at him. He was so dumb, right? Yeah. You know what I mean? He was so stupid. Yeah. He was dangerous, yeah, yeah. for sure. Yeah. But at least you looked at you know, Everything he said was dumb, you know. But this guy's dangerous. Yeah. You know, with his fucking Pentecostal bullshit.
politicians lining their pockets, landlords raising the rent. the stars the media is too scared to tell the truth they got too much to lose if we don't do something soon in Paris and I was reading all the shit about people going nuts on toilet paper. Oh. It's the new currency. Is it? Yeah. Toilet yeah. paper? Well, we have Bitcoin, now it's toilet paper. Yeah. Yeah, people are always saying to me, you should get Bitcoin, but you should get paid in Bitcoin. I went, no, I don't think so. I'm going to do this song. I wasn't planning to do it, but after I went to Aaron's, is Aaron still here? After I went to Aaron's for lunch the other day. Who's that guy over there? I went to Aaron's and we were watching a video of uh, at the Fibonacci Centre and I really liked the groove I got that day so I thought it, it's time to do it, Aaron. because 
Jean Guy did a solo once at the Gaslight Club on this song. It was one of the best, most interesting harmonica solos I've ever heard in my life. You're not going to hear it tonight. No. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that will be what do you say? <laughs> no. No, really. Remember that day? You... It's on video. Is that the yeah, it's on. It's the same thing. Yeah. It really was a quite an incredible version. Very good. In A minor. A minor. <laughs> it's by Willie Dixon, the great Willie Dixon, who used to be the mayor of Fremantle. Erin? Yeah. No, no, really, that solo was just, it I was. remember, I'll never forget it. I mean, you've done a lot of great solos, but that one solo was, I remember just standing there going, shit, you know. Do you remember that, Al? Was I playing on that? Oh, <laughs> no. <laughs> <laughs> well, I thought it might have been like the gas light. It was, it was yeah. but it was... That's before I get up. Anyway, it's a great song actually, it's about, it's for women really.
good when your baby puts on a even ground. Why make you feel so good when your baby puts on a evening gown? Must be the same old thing that made the preacher lay Bible down. That same thing. about it, whole world's a crying about it, whole world's a fighting about it, whole world's a crying about it, whole world's a fighting about it, whole world's a crying about it. The same thing is. Mayor of Fremantle. <laughs> Unless Alan, Alan uh, sort of tries for it, I reckon he'd get it. Just going to do one or two more. Thank you very much for coming and leaving the bastards. So. <laughs> Just like old times, just like the Gaslight Club, but no, no one here and our uh, shit, that's good. <laughs> Is it? He's the always mayor of Fremantle. Always mayor. Oh. Always mayor. You are? Yes. Is the mayor of Fremantle here? No, I'm not, I'm not hip enough for him. So he, he's too hip for me. Things have changed. I met him. Oh, he's not there anymore? Uh, he's gone. Huh? He's gone. He's gone. It's gone. The pop star DJ mayor. He's, <laughs> he's fucked up, hasn't he? The mayor of the mayor of Fremantle, the DJ musician, he's gone. He's infiltrating federal politics. He came to my house one day. He came to my house. I couldn't believe it. He did. He came to the front door, knocked on the door, and said, "You know who I am?" I said, "Yeah." Shut the door, and he goes. He knocked again. He said. I was just seeing if you were, you were going to vote for me. I said, fuck off. <laughs> I said, fuck off, you jerk. He said, oh, you're a musician, eh? I said, yeah, not like you. <laughs> like Bob and Greg on a rainy night. I stumbled down the streets of Northbridge in the moonlight. <laughs> this is a true story. I see a guy there looking like Al Pacino. Actually, Aaron looks a bit like Al Pacino now with his new hair. So I stand up and I ask him a simple question. Do you remember a movie you made many years ago with Gene Hackman about hobos called Scarecrow? Right, he rolled his big black eyes with me and he said, Stavros. No, he didn't say that actually. He said, Steve, but I prefer Stavros. You gotta think about a real career. No, it's a different song. Where was I after that? He said, I don't remember that movie at all. He was frothing at the mouth, frothing at the mouth, frothing at the mouth, frothing at the mouth, frothing at the mouth. This is about a movie with Gene Hackman and Al Pacino about hobos. I got a new song called I'd Rather Be a Hobo Than a Bobo. But I forgot the lyrics. Oh, 
already know. things like that. I got better things to do with my time to think about things like that.
story? Well, as true as any story. Jeez, there's a noisy crowd downstairs, though. What's going on down there? Must be noisy. They're just like hearing themselves. They're fucking loud, aren't they? Come up. Yeah, fucking idiots. Probably watching some fucking dumb TV show or The Voice or some fucking... Should we bring him up? Yeah. Ah, fuck him, mate. I'd rather play to a small crowd that are interested. Yeah, that's... Listen to him. Hey, shut up, you fucking bunch of bastards. That's alright, Big Brother. No respect for your elders. Actually, I've entered Big Brother. Have you? <laughs> and The Voice. No, really, I've entered the voice so and Big Brother, brother in France. We're going to. Where's uh, John Keys? He's still here. Yeah, exactly. We're going to bring him up now because we're going to finish off with the song here. Yeah. Because yeah. I'm playing at the casino later, so. Casino. <laughs> <laughs> what, what the crowd. Are you crowd hey? We're all coming. Yeah, yeah, you yeah. bunch of bastards. You wouldn't get let him look like that, mate. I I got my suit in the car. <laughs> This one's all about the birds and the bees, you could say, eh? This is about the birds and the bees, and I think you all need a lesson in that, I reckon. Thanks, dude. It's Hank's birthday tonight. Happy birthday, Hank. How about a big happy birthday, Hank? 49. Hank, stand up. Take a, ba take a bow. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday. Be back in free, are you bunch of fucking bastards? You know? <laughs> anyway, there's a song about the birds and the bees. Written by my favourite singer. Guess who my favourite singer is? Nah, he's a wanker. He's a fucking wanker. No, no, fuck that. I don't know, who's my favourite singer? Anyone that guesses my favourite... Uh, not my favourite singer of all time, no, I was just going to say, not my favourite singer internationally, my favourite Australian singer. <laughs> Anyone that guesses the right singer, you take the song, you take after the end of the song... No. No. <laughs> Anyone who guesses the singing win, wins the CD. What'd you say? Colin Hay. No. Keep going. Close second, though. Jimmy Barnes? No. John Farnham. No. I'll do this song. At the end of this song, you can all have a choice. You know, this. I'll go around the room. And I won't give favouritism to Hank just because it's his birthday. No, I'm going to give away a free song. As long as someone guesses the number. Paul Kelly. No. Hey, I like Paul, Paul Kelly. Kelly. But yeah, no. Very good.
till the road's about 30. I want to run away, but I was on my own. Well, she told me to lay the scissors machine operator. She said she liked the way I sang into the microphone. Said, man, my like a spider to a fly. Jumped right ahead of my whip. Sit up, fed up, go down, go round. Now to the place at the bar I'm at, I'm just. She's a rinse stop long on my leg. So I said, how about it? You fly, jump right ahead of my way. I saw him when I was very young. Quite incredible singer, yes, nice. I've supported this guy quite uh, three times actually. The Kudale Hotel, some other hotel, the Fly By Night. You gonna do another song, mate? Or? Oh, yeah. Gee, mate. Yeah, I know, but do, do I ever tell the truth on stage, mate? No. No, I keep going, there's no. Alright. Who is it? No. Yeah, put a sound All right. 